Hi everybody, my name is Fiona Milton, aka Flaming Dragons. Hope everyone is having a good day. Excuse my dry skin, everyone. But I want to know, come on and tell you some sad news that I wanted to do yesterday, but I decided to do the review for do little but it had to take me some time to actually to talk about this because you know it's a sad moment and you know maybe some people out there don't care but i care you know um you know james lifton um he passed away on monday at the age of 93. Now, if you don't know who James Lifton is, he's in charge of that show, The Inside Actors Studio. He brings stars and asks them deep questions about themselves, asks their parents what their occupation, and if your family is in the an an actor they want to know about them too and um and the one successful I could say that I enjoyed James Lipton is that this man did his research he when I was watching an interview with him um he said that he would lock himself in a room for three to four weeks fighting research watching all um the movies that the person who was in called the um the school uh wherever he trained in ask some questions write them down and it comes in with a blue card and that's where he will ask them questions when he sit down in the after studio and they also have potential actors who sit out in the audience and ask them ask the actors questions at the end and the one person who has the opportunity who was the audience and sat in the actor chair was Bradley Cooper Bradley Cooper was there when Robert Robert De Niro um was sitting in inside the actor's studio with James Lipton and he was talking about his career and Bradley had the opportunity to ask Robert De Niro a question so when um, Bradley Cooper had the opportunity um, to go back James Lipton always wanted to bring Bradley Cooper back to the inside actor's studio to give his take on his career and it's really amazing to see you know at least one person from the studio into a chair and I think that is a wonderful and beautiful thing and and you know it is not easy to lose a person Especially James Lipton because he also was an actor too. And he used to write um, like shows, like Broadway shows. So he was a producer and he directed and he was a star in, in TV and movies. So it was, it was good. But I was really saddened by his death and and i didn't even know he was like 93 years old but that's a a long life to live and i just want to give his family you know you know he was i just want to say thank you to his family to allowing him to grace us with so much life and um 
so much love and respect to an actor and to bring in all that information that we did not know about in certain actors. You know, my favorite interview that he ever, ever did was the Will Smith one and especially the Robin Williams one. That one was so good. And the one that was captivating and very truthful and down to the core was the Dave Chappelle um, inside the actor studio. And if you ever have a chance to watch any of his inside the actor studio um, stuff, you could watch it a little bit on YouTube. They don't have all of them. Only a few, but they have um, some of them on Amazon that you could buy. But I really enjoyed James Lipton and the show. The show is going to be a mess. Um, I'm giving my condolences to the Lipton family. And may he rest in peace. And... Who knows? He might have Robert Williams greeting him through the door. Saying, so we're glad to have you. But I hope everybody's having a wonderful day.